This is yin push hands. Notice how the palm is turning up and it feels like you're pushing into a bag of air. This is different than the yang push hands. The palm is turned up and I pull him into my own center as I go in at the waist. I literally suck his attack in and then re-push. Notice how it looks a little bit like a figure eight if both people are doing this. Now what you can do here is you can alternate yang push hands and yin push hands so that you're getting a combination of the yang and the yin push hands. Now if I push wrongly, then he's just going to pull me over. That means all my weight was in the top of my body. When you push, you have to push into your front leg so that you don't get pulled off balance. There are two ways that we can push. We can either use a yang push, which means I push with the power coming from my back leg. Now, I don't push when Martin's doing all the right things, but when his hand's like this, that's a mistake. When his hand's like that, it's okay, yin, but if he brings his hand into his chest, that's called a broken wrist, and I'm allowed to attack him then with a powerful push coming from my back leg with a twist from the waist, just like that. Now, that's called yang attacking. There is another attack, however, which is called yin attacking, which is sort of like the repulsed monkey from Taiji, and the power comes from that front leg. So when he does this same mistake again, I push. Now, I immediately push back with my front leg, and the power comes out of my right hand, pushing him over. Now, this one doesn't work over the same distance that the other one works. It's sort of uh, a, a short-term attack. And then you can re-attack with the other, just like that. Power comes straight from the front leg. Women find this technique very easy to master. It's a very sneaky attack. Page. Once you get a little bit more advanced, this circle here can come in a little further. As long as you're not going like that, your circles become much smaller. And then we try what's called the rooting technique, whereby if Martin attacks my chest with a push, that's it. You just, you just stand there and just take it. Take it on your butt. So what's happening here is all that energy there is going back down to my back leg and it's literally being rooted to the ground.